Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day, Episode 2. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. Welcome back. And if this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. All right, this is episode two of the Sunday Shave of the Day, which means down in the description, I've got a link there for you to episode one, how this shave began. We're gonna continue on with my Parker, and this is Best Silver Steel, and it is just a beautiful razor. All right, look at that, quarter hollow, very nice. And for our soap tonight, we are using Sterling Soap Company Gatlinburg. And guys, this is just marvelous. If you like to be out in the woods, like I like to be out in the woods, this soap's for you because it, it really has a wonderful woodsy scent, just like walking through the woods, all right? And now I got my uh, Omega 10,098, right? Load it up and let's get going. Let's get our lather on. Yeah. All right. So now, just to remind you that uh, on the first and third Friday of every month, I go ahead and do Friday special videos. So they're shave related videos. Most of the time, not shaving videos, but shave related. And uh, I answer your questions there and will, uh, you know, just leave your questions in the comments or leave a comment or if you have an idea for a Friday special that you would like to see just go ahead put it in the comments and this is how you can participate in this channel and guys it, it this channel really is about you so you know the more questions you ask and if I can film it and put it on YouTube we'll do it all right Plus, I also have many helpful links in the description there. Go ahead and explore and see if you can find something there that's helpful. I think you will. All right. So now this is episode two of the Sunday Shave of the Day, which means this is a pass and a half. So what we're doing, we're going to go across the grain on my neck. Now going up instead of down. Then we're going against the grain on my cheeks like this. Then right through here on my neck and my chin, that's going to be against the grain as well. So let's get going. There we go. Nice. Okay. Now switching hands, we're going to do this other side.
Okay, now, I'm going to change up that handle. There we go. May have hit a little bump right there too. Don't know. Don't know yet. No big deal either way. But we'll find out. Okay, there's those. Yeah, hit a bump. Hit a bump right there. So apparently this is my night. I got another little one there. No big deal though. It'll be fine. There's that. Get a little soap on that one. Get a little soap on that one. And it'll be fine. No big deal. Yep. Okay. Now. Okay, now the part that I was really worried about was that little scratch, which is fine. That is not a problem. Go figure, right? <laughs> oh, well. well. Let's get that cleaned off, see how we did. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay, those cheeks are right where we want them. Definitely good. Oh, and that neck's pretty good, too. We're going to go ahead and finish the shave off with the half pass, though. So now this is going to be across the grain primarily on my neck, okay? And it's a little unconventional, so 
you know, when you guys are looking at this, you need to decide what you want to do. Um, and it all depends on how your beard grows, too. It really does. It's This is very personal kind of a situation. Okay, for me, what I'm going to show you, though, works. And it's really the only thing i found that does work to get my neck really good. All right, so here we go. Holy wow, that is sweet, really is. That's incredible, what a great shave. All right, switching hands. All right, there you go. There you have it. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful shave. All right, get that blade cleaned off. Now, let's wash our face off. Oh, wow. Nice. Oh, that neck is brilliant. Really is. All right, now alum everywhere and there we go now we we'll dry that off Okay, now, Thayer's Lemon Witch Hazel. Excellent stuff, guys. This, if you like lemon, it is marvelous for the skin. And it has a wonderful scent. Seriously, if you like lemon, this is going to be for you, definitely. All right, now, next up, we're going to kind of do a cologne thing tonight. Osage Rub. Give me that menthol. Good stuff. Oh, my goodness. Now, this, you don't need a lot. This really kicks a punch, right? This will kick it. Wow. Nice. And now, for me, I try to keep that away from my eyes. 
because it'll make my eyes water. It is so strong and so good. All right, and that is wonderful. Now, we are going with Nivea Post Shea Balm. You know, taking care of the skin. Wow, that menthol is kicking in. I'm getting a nice cooling effect. Marvelous. Okay, really good. And now we're just going to put on that Nivea Poche Bomb. And we are done. Nice. Hey, thank you so much. Really appreciate you and all you do for me. Click here to see episode one, how this shave began. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.